We're broadcasting live from Hexon, Texas, home of the spoilers. We're at AK-47 Stadium where the fans are required by law to carry firearms 24-7. So put your bulletproof vests on and let's go, America! Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The Nashville Lycans battle. The Hexon Oilers. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Yo, seriously, man, you think you'd go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. Hope you got your mutant tailgate buzz on. I know I did. The teams are revving up on the sidelines, and we are ready for some mutant football. Grim Blitzer along with Bricks and Bricks Jr. Yeah, Grim, I had a little eye open at myself at the mutant bloodmobile park next to the taco truck outside. Called a lobotomy shot. Raccoon rabies blood and red bull crap. Hoo-hoo. Yeah, I can tell your mouth looks like a hot shaving cream dispenser. <laughs> Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And that'll be second down and four. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Grim. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. The ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey. Anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong Il. Oh, with the brain scrambler. First down and one. it in for the touchdown. Well, that's a strange penalty called right there. I'm starting to notice that this red light's talking, and it don't make much sense. No, but he's making a lot of dollars. First down and long, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. First down and forever. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were made out of butter. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Ooh, 
Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, three. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. Hot one. when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made into dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and the cornerback is down. Zoom in on his face. I want to see if the little bastard's crying. <laughs> For it. This could get uglier than the baby resulting from an orcish family reunion. The quarterback has had enough and calls a murder ball dirty trick to lay waste to the defense. Hey, that defender and the defense was caught with their pants around their ankles. The offense converts on fourth down and keeps the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. This is your brain, and this is your brain on Berserk. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham and sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? Now, yeah, still working on my slimy here, Briggs. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. Second down in a lot. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stumped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the all-you-can-eat buffets? They're not as literal as you'd think. Third down and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. They let the punt drop, and it will be down by the defense. And it's first and ten. When I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Go, oh, man, about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Oh, oh, could it be mine? And it's first and ten. A good run.
run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the change of score, did it? How good can it be? Second down and five. Put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Hey man, nobody can touch you with that ball. I take all you need. That's right. Hey, Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't wrong. In my oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And that'll bring up third and one. Not going down. First down. And this guy is a stud, Bricks. Yeah, telling me. Nice run. No, I mean, he's a real stud. He works at the Mutant Stud Farm weekends and summers. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. <laughs> Threads the needle for a first down. First and four. Second down and seven. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Third down and three. There's no reason to go for it here, but they do anyway. And can he just use his beast boost? That play was like the offense was playing rock, paper, scissors, and the defense was playing rocket launcher. And now the defense has the ball because they came to play. And it's first and ten. Right rage ignites that deep down violent rage and makes you unstoppable. I'll take a run. A lot of guys talk about stepping up their game, Bricks. He just stepped up and blew up. <laughs> He's got a lot of guts, doesn't he? And you can see the ground crew cleaning him up now. Hot potato gets him every time. Second down and ten. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. Third down and five. <laughs> Second down and 
The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Second down and ten. He had it for a second there. Third down and ten. What is this, Andy's wrestling? Smart move there as they call a timeout trying to get the ball back for another shot. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And the punter has one job to do, and that's punt the ball. Preferably no return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. And the ball is lateral to his teammate. We're talking street ball here. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Nice run for five yards. They stopped the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have nine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. for a first down to keep the drive alive. And they are out of timeout. The clock just became their greatest enemy. Really? The clock? The clock, Grim? I can smash a clock. That's not a great enemy. We're not talking about waking up at the crack of noon. We're talking about the NFL, you moron. tell you it is. We're at the start of the third quarter in a nail biter. The teams line up for the second half kickoff. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's first and ten. I 
seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. The Roid Rage Dirty Trick transforms a player into a rampaging lunatic for the duration of the play. I know that's typical of all NFL players, but this is different. <laughs> Trust me, very different. Touchdown! Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. Defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. Uh, I'd love to murder ball that. Pow! With the brain scrambler. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Sticks moving, he picks up five on that play. Second down and five. And he held on to that one for a first down. First and four. And here comes the extra point attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Second down in a very lot. And then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they're hands, but he sure has a good set of hands. 
And it's first and ten. Oh, what a brutal hit! And it's first and ten. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Second down and more than the QB would like. Caught for the first down. First down and five. heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Second down and five. each other at bay for now but there's still plenty of time to bribe refs and kill the other team star players so it's anyone's game really bricks third and two and they stack the line and he gets his bell rung for a yard this one's so easy they should call it bricks mom <laughs> two jokes are the ones that hurt the most he is automatic! Nice kick! Boring. Just give him the points and let's move on. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. Yeah. 
And it's first and ten. First and ten. He grabs it and picks up four on that reception. Second down and six. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross pitching, unbelievable. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. Murphy Brown! What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. And it's first and ten. It's about a three-yard pickup. Second down and seven. He's got his beast boost working. He picks up a two. Third down and five. Oh, he's going berserk. The ball. And we know this quarterback likes to play with soft balls, but the defense, they're playing with big balls and just crushed his balls. And they'll line up for the punt here. Nice punt. Should move them back nicely. Nice catch. And he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life expectancy. Oh, man. He just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and ten. And that'll give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And it's first and ten. Chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. When I was... 
was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're gonna dump his ass. Second down and a lot. Two minutes left in the game. Hang on. Second down and long. He picks up 10 yards on that play. First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. And that'll bring up third and one. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. A timeout is called by the quarterback. They have one left. And it's first and ten. down give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off he is deadly and that's it that's the last time out it's score or die from here out and it's first and ten oh and did he just put on a display there Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. The QB threads the needle for two points. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. And what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. They stump the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. target more often. The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused. He scores! Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Oh, and that's 
That's what it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grin. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Second down and two. That's right, folks. It's all tied up, and we are headed to overtime. I don't know how many players are left alive, but the rest are headed to sudden death. They should call this game Mutant Death League. Breaks overtime is a war with some basic rules. The first touchdown wins the game, but if the team that receives the kickoff gets a field goal, then the other team is allowed a possession too. After that, whomever scores wins. Here comes the kickoff. And it's first and ten. Picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it, too. Third down and ten. That's a six-yard gain. Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. It's good. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Oh, nice hit. It's first and ten. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down in a mile. catch on the play every little bit counts those three yarders might grow up to be somebody one day second down and we've got to pick up at least half of this oh that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life third down and the punter is warming up There's an eight-yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. They're going for it. And the defense is licking their mutant lips. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. <laughs> <laughs> and it's first and ten. And that is caught for a first down.
And it's first and ten. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. And that's a catch for three yards. And that'll bring up third down and seven. And he's running like a moose. He picks up five on that play. Ballsy? Stupid, maybe? I guess we'll decide after we see how this goes. But probably stupid. And the defense won that one handily. The offense fails on fourth down and turns the ball over. The Hexon Oilers win the game today. That was one hell of a slugfest. That was worth the price of admission, right, guys? Well, I paid for admission. I expect girls dancing on a pole or something. Girls, wait a minute. I want a lap dance. You don't even have a lap, you little freakazoid. Follow me. Let's see what the MVP has to say about today's outcome. Yeah, man, she's going to get on now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SM thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Heart Corporation. They get it right every up.